All right, so what's up guys? It's me, Faith or Maliminous, and I'm actually doing a CUDCOM on this channel, which is really weird. I really have an important update to do before I get into the synopsis for this episode and etc. Because I did 15 and not 14, so there was some misunderstandings over there. So I'll go ahead and do 14 for you guys. So if you guys don't know, I do do a lot of gaming stuff. And recently I started doing gaming stuff for Maliminous. I separate the two gaming stuff because if you guys haven't noticed, Maliminous, besides Maliminous 2, which is a group of artists and you know stuff like that and we do mainly pretty sexualized stuff uh it's pretty pg it's like i would say like pg 13 i would say so i separate the two because one's not so pg and i want to keep these channels pretty pg come on and if you guys notice we here at Malimnus, we're not afraid to make new channels. Pretty much, we started the gaming channel, or we didn't even really start it up. We restart. And I've been uploading to that a bunch of game stuff. But the thing is, I really want to upload it here. And that's pretty much it, guys. I'm going to really want to upload some of the gaming commentaries and cut comms on this channel. And I don't think that's asking too much, but if you guys are really adamant against that, then obviously I won't, and I'll continue using uh, Malumnus Games for my more PG uh, cut comms and stuff like that. Of course, it's not just going to be Call of Duty, obviously. It's going to be the other games that we've been putting out on there, and whatever theory videos that we have that are related to games and stuff like that. Yeah, that's pretty much all I really wanted to say on the update then, guys. And I guess I should also mention that it's also my birthday tomorrow. So if you guys want to give me a cool birthday gift, let's get 200 likes. That would be awesome. That would be incredible. Also, shout out to the uh, Adam and Elizabeth who found my channel at school. Okay, so episode 14 is supposed to air on September 12th. So it's not that far off. And it's a rarity episode, and it's weird because it's like back-to-back -back rarity episodes, which some of you guys really love Rar Rar, so you guys would probably be happy. Me, personally, I don't care. It's new pones. That's just good to me. <laughs> as long as it's not a spike episode, I'm happy, and even then, I'd take back-to-back -back spike episodes opposed to like another year hiatus or something like that. They are really stunning. And also, before I once again start this uh, synopsis, this probably won't be the format for many of the synopsis. It's just that, I don't know, I just kind of wanted to do a cut gum. Alright, so it goes as follows. It's really short. Rarity's dreams of owning a boutique in Canterlot finally comes true, but it comes at a price Rarity may not be willing to pay. Well, she was offered in uh, the Manhattan episode, she was offered... A position there if you guys remember but she would have to leave Ponyville and Coco Pomel I believe uh, was the one who got the position because of that so it's pretty transparent as to what the price is that she's gonna have to be paid it's obviously not gonna be a monetary loss because they say that she finally has the ability to open it up there which means she already has the finances in order but it's gonna be she's gonna have to leave her friends and actually that is pretty, I don't know, troubling. If you guys have ever had to move and stuff like that, especially when you're still in school, it's really hard. I've moved so many times that I became numb to it. And actually, uh, my professors were surprised when they, I could actually, you know, talk during an interview thing. Uh, because I'm re relatively quiet. I wasn't always like that. It wasn't just a YouTube thing that I was vocal. I would move so much, though, growing up that I would be extremely vocal and energetic and I would make friends, like, every four seconds, you know, and then I would keep on moving and keep on having to restart my group of friends and restart and restart and restart and restart, and restart until I kind of got numb to it and I just... I don't know, I just kind of said, why am I really bothering go out of my way to make friends when I'm just gonna leave them in like you know a couple of months I mean, that's just the realistic part of being in a military family you, you move a lot so while the whole aspect of moving may not seem like a whole big deal it kind of can be and even then they're not super far away from what we've seen in the show but there's that whole out of sight out of mind mentality and you may not think that that's real but it is real. There are so many awesome friends that I think about on occasion, but I don't really have any contacts with them anymore. 
and it's because we moved away. Well, I couldn't really get the clip, but I went 50 and 18. I had so many opportunities. Anyways, guys, it's been Faith from Olympus. Peace to them out, guys. I'll see you guys, whatever, make next. I am actually working on an Everything's Wrong with Steven's Universe video. Uh, anyways, guys, please, please let me know what you think about me doing. So it'll usually be about the fandom and stuff like that. And I probably won't do them every day, but probably like every couple of days and stuff like that. So if you guys are interested, uh, please, please let me know. 200 likes would be an amazing birthday gift. Uh, let's go. I know you guys can do it. You guys do it all the time. And I love you guys for that. I get so much support from you guys. I love you guys so much. See you guys later.